The goal is to make the hub a swimmable and fishable by the year 2020. That's right, and today we are representing the goals of Swimble and Fishable, which are major goals of the Healthy Harbor 2020 initiative. Our class has been working on this initiative for the pub and after school program. When our shoppers told us about these goals, they seemed like they were hard to reach. But after we thought about it, we all realized how important it was just to do it. When the first white European came up here, Captain John Smith in 1608, this was all wetlands. So this was a much more pristine environment where Fishing and swimming was done on a daily basis with our native populations. But the last wetlands right there, that was built by Baltimore City, inner city kids back in 1989, 1990. And it's still there, and it's a home to fish and crabs and turtles and snakes. But you know what? Those grasses die each year. We have to replant them because of the pollutants that are still in the harbor. So Mike, we've got to get this harbor clean so those grasses can flourish and that the fish and crabs can have a, a safe, uh, a clean place to live. I think it's important to clean up the harbor so the fish and the animals can have a better life and also so the water won't be polluted. Yeah, I, I do think it'll happen because they're testing and they're trying to just clean it up so it could be a good environment, just not to us, but fish and animals too. That now is the time, as our students have said, now is the time to take action and make investments in our city's future. There are services and infrastructure critical to the functioning of our city and the everyday health and well-being of our cities that we need to address. The city cannot grow without well-maintained infrastructure, schools, parks, roadways, bridges, and water systems. And we all have a role to play and a personal responsibility to do our part to keep our city's assets clean, healthy, and safe. We have a heavy involvement. Our campuses are on the waterfront. It's important that this water be fishable and swimmable by 2020 for, uh, for the young people and the next generation. And uh, I'm looking forward to swimming across soon.